Good morning, everybody. Mike Vaki, PrinceandTrader.com, here with your Wednesday morning pre-market webcast. Okay, daily chart. Uh, we'll look at the hourly in a minute. Sorry we didn't have a webcast yesterday. We were in the middle of transitioning uh, to our new, um, new web-based, Mac-friendly, mobile-friendly uh, chat interface. So we're really excited about that. Uh, we're really excited about the technical capabilities that that gives us. And uh, onward and upward here at PrincetonTrader.com. So check that out. Uh, it's a great time to come and take a trial and uh, see what the new setup is all about. We're really excited about it. Now, as for the market, for the last two days, we've been battling over the, the daily mid band, the green line there, the 20 day simple moving average. The bears have pushed below it both days. They have not been able to close below it. Every time they get down into the low 60s, yesterday was 63, 64, they bounced it. Last time, when they, when they bounced it back up, they got over the top of the key 22, uh, 67 half area, and that caused a, you know, a, a, a basically what you would have to say was a short squeeze into the last hour right here. So we got down into this area on Monday, we got back down into the area on Tuesday, we started to establish 63 as pretty reliable support for a bounce. And when 67 half, that really, you know, the bulls need to take advantage of the opportunity. That 67 half that had been resistance for so long now seems to want to be support. They need to use that as a springboard to get back to, to new all-time highs. They had their upper band ride going. Honestly, they blew it. Now, we are going to be battling today over two key areas. You've got a brand new monthly pivot, first of the month, 227508. It was support during Globex last night. And you've still got the weekly pivot up here at 2280. Uh, weekly pivot has, you know, it's, it's, been, it's been decent uh, resistance overnight. They've been fighting over the level. This was the area that broke. Um, Monday morning and caused the first move down into the 63 area. The bulls are going to have to regain weekly pivot. They're going to have to, you know, just basically win this band of price. This band of price is going to decide. It's going to decide today, and it's probably going to decide the week. So 75 to 80, monthly pivot to weekly pivot. Win this band, and you win the week. If the bear, if the bears can get back down, seal this band off, get back below 63, 64. Close a day below the daily mid band. Don't just trade below it, but close below it. Then they can start to um, they can start to push towards lower prices, head down into the area of the lower band on the daily chart, which really isn't all that far away. You're just talking about 2252. The bands are starting to tighten up again on the daily, so we continue this battle. I don't care if we battle. We can battle like we did yesterday. If you want to battle in a 15, 18 handle range, that's great. I don't like battling in a four handle range. Okay, But as long as they give us a range to trade, we can find all kinds of opportunities inside of that. Okay, everybody have a fantastic day. That's all I got. Follow us on Twitter, at Princeton Trader. Come check out our website, PrincetonTrader.com, and come take a free trial in our chat room. I'll be back tomorrow morning with another webcast. Trade them well, everybody.